boxing floor. As I studied about it, I got a lot of interest in it. And I saw articles that uh, boxing should be banned and boxing shouldn't be banned. And I'm on the side that boxing should be banned. Of course, boxing is violent and boxing is very, uh, boxing can cause damage. But now they have a lot of safety equipment that uh, can block a lot of can block damage. Before, in, before boxing, they used to kill people and they used to kill, uh, fight until they one died. Bo and boxing is not just a sport. It is how some people make a living. It's a livelihood. Also, boxing is a part of culture and history. Did you know that boxing existed since ancient Greek? about 2000 BC. Also, it was an Olympic sport since 688 BC. That is like when our ancestors were like babies. Also, if boxing is banned, there will be, there will actually be more trouble. Boxing, if, if boxing is banned, how are the governments going to handle all of the, all the fans of boxing, boxing champions and coaches? Now they lost now, they're, now they lost all their entertainment and their jobs. That's not the only problem. If boxing was banned, there would be some underground boxing. Underground boxing is something illegal and bad and horrifying. If you knew about it, you would you'd be appalled at it. It is something like, it is something that people that do drugs and alcoholics bring boxers and bet on them. This would be another problem. So I'm not the government, but I, don't want boxing to okay. Eric, once again, you know, two minutes, so you know, close to three. Um, yeah, you're very, you're, you're a very, very good speaker. It's very nice to listen to you, and I thought your examples were good, and it was very, very clear. Um, a few things. So number one, at the beginning of your speech, so after your snappy end, make sure you say, I'm going to talk about my three points, this, this, and this, right? Otherwise, I don't know what you're going to talk about. And then just try to expand each point by a little bit. So everyone, if you're having trouble filling your time, so one of your points was about livelihood, and you said, um, and what about the boxers and the coaches? It's their livelihood. And then you moved on to the next point. Stay with that for a bit longer. So what about what about the boxers? It's their livelihood. And then you can ask ask the audience, like, is it fair if we take away people's jobs for nothing? Is it fair for this people, Oh, you made a million dollars before, now you're going to make nothing. Talk, just try to bring up a few more things about that. Uh, rather than just saying, you know, it's a livelihood and moving on, say why is it important that they may still make money, things like that. So just everyone's work on expansion, that was very good. Good job, Eddie. 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 Good job, Eddie.